What we need you to do is tell us, go ahead and talk to the camera, and talk to us about what you're doing. So what are you doing in there? Well, we are making a space balloon, but right now we're um, understanding how the balloon works and how the parachute works. Basically the fundamentals. Yeah. And we're trying to find a way to make the ascension rate 16 point, 16 and a half feet per second and the descension rate 16 and a half feet per second. So what are you doing to do that? What are the, some of the things you've been doing and some of the experiments? Tell us, tell us about some of the little mini experiments where you guys can tell us. Um, one, we've, we figured out the circumference of our helium-filled balloons. And we used the circumference to find out the radius, radius. and the volume. Did you use I'm water not, displacement for anything? Yeah. Yes. Yes. We so used that as another with? method of volume. Okay. Um, so tell us about the parachutes. So well, we're Let's hear right, from these guys okay. for a little bit. That way everybody gets a chance to speak. Yeah. Um, so we're making parachutes, which is attaching to our payload, which is an empty water bottle. And right now, we're all just making parachutes of different shapes. And are you doing any graphing or anything like that? We are. Uh, do well, we do have like a little packet that we're writing down information in. So you got a stopwatch in there? Yeah. Tell us about that one. Uh, we used that for an experiment where we um, know, checked out how different weights um, created different. Uh, like if they if the balloon ascended, descended, yeah. or had an equilibrium, or met or reached its equilibrium, All right, and then now. we had timed um, how long it took to get to the ceiling um, with a certain weight attached. So tell me about Friday. What's going to happen Friday? So we're going to launch a space balloon into the sky. And we are going to get all the measurements and records from the space balloon flight. And, but there's going to be strong winds, so we want it to go up fast, so it's not going to go. So it's not going to go like a sideways. And that's why a, a long distance. That's yeah. why we want it to be able to have a 16 and a half feet per second ascending and descending time. So it doesn't like blow around away sure. from because the staff has to go get it. Yeah, we don't want it any. You don't have to go get it. Yeah, we don't want it ending up in Canada. Ah, very <laughs> good. Okay, so has this been a fun project for you? Yeah. Um, so far, yeah. It's Pretty interesting, been, actually. Yeah. It's a very educated process. Tell us how you look forward to doing these activities. Do you guys think about this like in the morning before you come to school? No. Is it at least fun when you get here? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. How is this different from like a regular classroom? Because it's it's focusing on one topic, not like one like not like two or three in one session. And so you get to and, and there's more like hands on activity, a lot more hands on activity than a normal classroom. And here we do like way more experiments, and usually in normal classroom we usually fill out worksheets. Uh, okay, well, well, let's you get back in there. Um, any final words you want to say? Any thank yous? I'm, I'm pretty. Any I'm shout pretty, outs? I'm pretty excited yeah. about this. All right, cool. Thank you, guys. Good job, guys. Thank you. Nice job. Nice job, guys.